Hey guys, welcome back to EDC TV. Got a quick unboxing. I got the new Olight O-Pen 2 in the limited edition blue. Let's check it out. Don't go nowhere. All right, guys, welcome back. Let's bust this bad boy open and see what we got. Uh, I hate when I rip the box because then I wouldn't sell it anyway. I don't sell my gear. All right, check out this packaging. That's pretty cool. It's got this little blue thing you pull and it comes out. Ah, oh, this is a uh, hard plastic case instead of that little uh, plastic, little soft plastic. Wow, that is a cool looking blue, isn't it? Not much to review. You know it's the bolt action, so your tip comes out. You got the low, medium, and high functions. Pretty cool, though. It is a bright little pen light, man, if you think about it. It's crazy bright. Um, let's see how it writes on the box. Eh, it writes. Not much to, uh, to say about the Olight pen. Now, the packaging, it comes with the charger on the side of the plastic packaging there. And then a refill, which is right here. So that's pretty cool that they uh, give you a refill. Oh, there it is. Refill. And then the good old charger pops out like so. There it is. The USB charger. There you go. So that's everything. You get the limited edition blue. You get your power or charging cord and a refill. Um, let's talk though for a second because uh, this is going to be a two-part video. I just got in three new packs, backpacks. Um, and I tell you, you know, I was always a sling guy, but they don't make any good slings right now. I, I wish I can get Maxpedition or VanQuest to sit down with me because I have such great ideas to design such a, an awesome pack. Uh, I would love to do it, but who am I to them? I'm a nobody. Um, so this video is going to be a part two. I am going to show you my Vertex Gamut 2.0, the one I've been running since Florida. I have it back in rotation for about, I don't know, two or three weeks now. But I don't know if I should tell you the name or wait. Nah, I think I'm going to tell you the name. I recently got the Helicon Rex or Tex Bob. It's going to be a cool review. So following this video, we're going to roll right into that one. So don't go nowhere. Stay tuned for some more because this is just a short video on the O-Pen. Not much to say. It writes, it lights, whoopie do, and it's limited edition blue. Wow, that all rhymed. Pretty cool. Uh, I'm a poet and didn't know it. So stay tuned. More to come. Check out the backpacks. EDC TV. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I got some in my pack right here. Let me get it for you. Hold on. Oh, man. Oh. Don't you just hate when you go in your pack and everything falls out on the floor? I mean, it's ridiculous. I wish they had a pack that opened up, like big open up arms, and all your stuff could stay inside. Man, a guy can dream, can he? What's that? Yeah, I got one of those. Hold on one second. Nothing fell out? Stay tuned. Check out this new pack. It is off the hook. All right, guys. Here she is. Say hello to the Helican Bob. Or bug out bag, as they call it. So check it out, guys. I couldn't believe this. I saw it on YouTube. I said, I have to get one. I have to check this out. And I did. Bringing it for you guys. So... This is the bag. It is Kodora 1000, you know, Dinia. Um, Kodora, it has this other type of um, 
I don't know, it's like, see it's like stretchy material in the front pocket here. Uh, all YKK zippers. But when she opens up, okay, she clamshells just like the, um, you know, the gamut, um, which everybody's a big fan of. It has these straps here that bring the pack, the sides together. This way your stuff stays there. But what's what's amazing about this, okay? You undo these clap these clasps, excuse me. Now it not only clamshells, but it opens up. And now all your packs, okay, are molly webbed. There's all the different molly molly webbing in here. You can see it there, see where my fingers are. And you just take your tie tacks, tack it down. Now these pouches down yonder, these mesh pouches with the, um, the whatchamacallit, the tie downs, those are built into the pack. So some of my Maxpedition pouches, all I have to do is just slide them in, tug them down, and they're in. So you have two pouches on the side that hold pouches, okay? Then the in here, the inner part is two zipper ones, okay? Now these stay, you know, stitched to the bag. These don't come out. But how cool is that? I'm going to show you some still pictures now of this bag hanging, me holding it up, and nothing can fall out. This is an amazing bag. Uh, some of the cool features, this, the cover actually folds up and goes behind itself like so. And it has a clasp here, which goes under the handle, down, And, oh, I have the buckle backwards. I'm sorry about that. And now holds it clamshelled open like this. Okay, so now nothing can come out. Nothing can come out. This bag is what they call crazy cool. Okay. Um, I, I don't even know where else to begin. It has another pouch back here. Okay. Now what this is, is a front pouch that goes on the bag, which has magazine pouches and an own little, we'll call it man purse area with a strap, shoulder strap that you can then hook on and carry it like so, uh, maybe to forage, collect some, uh, you know, Tinder, whatever you have, whatever, whatever you decide to do. It also has another pad, which is just like a kneeling pad. You can put this down when you're out in the forest, in the woods, kneel on it so your knees don't get wet. Whatever you want to use this for, a pillow, whatever. Um, so it has this larger compartment in here, which stores those, those two things, which I think was really, really smart design. So wherever you go, you have these, but it doesn't bulk out the bag at all. It doesn't make the bag feel heavy or anything. So that's it, man. Look at this bad boy. Let me re-angle the camera up now. Just give me one. There we go. Look at this. <clears throat> Ain't going nowhere, guys. So I'm going to run this for about a week. Let's see how it works. Um, how things work and, and if it, you know is what I dreamed of. So stay tuned for the update because I will update you guys on it. So that's it for today, boys and girls. Thank you for tuning in. I'm just, I sound the way I do because I can't believe how cool this pack is. I've been looking for a pack like this since I got into EDC about two and a half years ago. And it finally here, a pack. I had actually taken my Vertex and I, Velcro all these to the back of my vertex bag and I still open it up and the velcro would peel off or something and it was just a nightmare Then my packs were on the being all sticky on the back had to throw them out So this is it. This is the dream bag. Now. Let's see if it can hold up to its uh, Hold it hold its own as they say I also have some more products coming guys So don't go nowhere stay tuned more videos to follow enjoy your Sunday and as always, stay safe, stay clean, but be kind to one another. ECTV is out.